Following the approval of the Cabinet of Ministers, the Iraqi Foreign Minister issued special instructions to the embassies regarding the issue of visas during Arba'in season. Fuad Hussein, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, ordered the Iraqi delegations to contribute their best to grant entry visas for the Arba'in pilgrimage. According to the official news agency of Iraq, WAA Ahmed Al Sahaf, the spokesman of the Iraqi Ministry of Foreign Affairs, announced in a statement on Friday that Iraqi embassies are working around the clock to facilitate the granting of entry visas to Iraq. A special emergency response room has been set up in the consular department of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs to monitor the implementation of this directive as best as possible. Al-Sahaf noted, adding that it is monitoring the activities of all Iraqi embassies so that the Arba'in ceremony can be carried out successfully. This official also emphasized that the ministry is furthering its efforts to promote religious tourism. It should be noted that Grand Ayatollah Shirazi has stressed for many years the necessity to facilitate the Arba'in pilgrimage for the visitors of Ram Hussein alayhi salam, especially in relation to passport and visa procedures. Accordingly, in his last public speech on Ashura Eve, his eminence addressed the Islamic governments, especially the government of Iraq, and recommended special considerations for passports and visa facilities for the Husseini Arba'in pilgrims. Fortunately, the Iraqi government has considered certain facilities for the Arba'in pilgrims in keeping with the Marja'at's recommendations and according to the instruction number 23437 of the Iraqi Council of Ministers. This means Pakistani, Afghan, Lebanese and Yemeni pilgrims who, are en who enter Iraq during Arba'in season are exempted from visa requirements.